We've got football, the leaves falling, a chill in the air, and hectic schedules. Indeed, fall has arrived. This time of year can be challenging for parents, finding the time to prepare family dinners during the week. Here with meal ideas that are nutritious, easy, and crowd-pleasing, Food Network star Chef Amanda Freitag. Good morning. Good morning, Mary. How are you? Hey, we're doing great. Hope you're doing well. Uh, first up, yes. your message to busy parents who don't always have the time to cook dinner. What is it? Uh, my number one tip is to keep it simple. You know, keep your recipes simple. Make them easy on yourself. Don't go crazy and try and make something extravagant during the week. And make yourself a list and do one-stop shopping. You know, you don't want your shopping trip to take too long either. Do it all under one roof. I recommend Walmart because they have everything in one place. I use farmland, all natural fresh pork, and it's there at Walmart. I get all my other seasonal ingredients, and then I go home and cook. So what are some of your favorite recipes using those products? Ah, well, pork to me is just, you know, autumnal mm -hmm. and delicious and tasty. I mean, it's something that it's my go-to. You know, we, chefs love pork, chefs love bacon. I use pork chops quite often, and I have this great recipe with sweet potatoes, which is so, Ooh. you know, so much saying fall, you know, mm -hmm. and the pork chops are seared in a pan. They have crispy bacon on top. You know, and if you want to go a little lighter, a little leaner, you can take a pork tenderloin, cut it, cook it. It's done in less than 10 minutes, and then you have a salad with protein. You can put it on top of arugula with apples, and it's lean, nutritious, but, you know, you have pork on there, so it's hearty entree. A few years back, there were uh, new guidelines released about the internal temperature, and I think some Americans are still a little unsure on the rules. Would you remind <laughs> us about that temperature and, and physically what should it look like when it's raining? Yeah, I mean, I think pork, you know, is always a question. I know my mom always asks me, mm -hmm. you know, what is it supposed to look like? Yeah. You know, should I cook it all the way? I mean, dry pork is not a very delicious entree. <laughs> so. You know, you can cook it to 145 degrees if you have a meat th thermometer, check it out. It can be a little pink. It doesn't have to be fully gray or brown, mm -hmm. you know. It can be a little pink, you know. This farmland all-natural pork has no artificial ingredients, no preservatives, so you can really feel good about what you're cooking and feel good about cooking it almost like a steak so it has the juices still left inside. Hey, here in Nebraska, we know how to cook steak, <laughs> so you're speaking our language exactly. there. Um, <laughs> any, any ideas using apples? Because that's another one of those fall staples that we enjoy uh, here in this part of the country especially, and I think that goes so well with pork. Absolutely. I mean, that's like peanut butter and jelly, mm -hmm. you know, pork and apples. And of course, you know, pork chops and applesauce has always been a favorite. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I kind of lighten it up and brighten it up. And when I make a salad, I thinly slice apples and put them in. And then if you put that warm pork tenderloin mm -hmm. on top, it just starts to melt the apples and they still stay crispy and sweet. And it's quick. You don't have to make an applesauce or make a baked apple. It's right there and it's still that fresh apple flavor paired with pork. That pork chops so and applesauce reminds me of the Brady Bunch. <laughs> I don't know if you're the Brady Alice. Bunch, exactly, yeah. me too. Uh, <laughs> is, there, is there one website, Amanda, that has some of the recipes and more ideas for our viewers? Absolutely. I have recipes with farm, farmland fresh por pork at walmart.com. Go to walmart.com. You'll see the recipes, and I hope you try them this fall because they're really easy and delicious. We're feeling inspired today. Thanks, Chef. Okay. Thank you. Thanks, Mike.